As the modern lighting industry evolves, there is an increasing need for test tools that include not only DMX and RDM capabilities, but also various Ethernet protocols. As lighting manufacturers implement RDMNet, SACN, ArtNet, and other Ethernet protocols, the DMX CAT-E is an essential tool for the future of lighting. The DMX CAT-E makes it easy for anyone to control, analyze, or test any DMX or Ethernet lighting fixture. Whether it's a simple LED PAR or a complex moving light. Like our original DMX Cat, the DMX Cat E system is comprised of a dongle and a suite of free mobile apps which are installed on a user's smartphone. The DMX Cat E dongle and the user's smartphone communicate wirelessly using Bluetooth LE technology with a working range of 50 feet or more, and without being physically connected, users can move about the workspace and use various apps while still using the phone for on-the-job communication. The charge on the DMX Cat E's battery will last over 20 hours and is recharged using a standard USB to USB-C cable and charger. The unit ships with a charging cable, pouch, and a belt clip with a safety point. Easily carried in a pocket, worn on a belt, or in the pouch, DMX Cat E works with both Android and iPhone, and the app can be downloaded for free from the Google Play Store and the Apple App Store. The suite of apps includes those apps also found when using the DMX Cat, including DMX Controller, Fixture Controller, DMX Tester, RDM Controller, and Dip Switch Calculator, as well as five new apps which include Timecode, MIDI, Ethernet, Cable, and PoE Testing. To begin using the DMX Cat E, you will need to pair your phone with the dongle, note your serial number on the back of your DMX Cat E, turn on your app, and turn on your dongle. Go to Settings and Device List. Your dongle will be shown. Choose it, and you are linked. Your phone and dongle will link automatically after this. The Timecode app allows users to view both SMPTE as well as MIDI timecode information. The user can select which type of timecode they would like to test and it will show on the screen in real time. The DMX Cat E will automatically choose the correct port to read from. In addition, we can bookmark cues to save and view them later. When I click bookmark, the time and cue number appear. Once I've bookmarked all my cues, I can save them and then upload the saved file onto a console. The MIDI application shows all MIDI data on the DIN connector. Users can use it as a sanity check to make sure you're seeing what you're supposed to see on the wire. As soon as I select Start, I can see the MIDI messages in real time. With MIDI, just as with the timecode application, some data can be stored with it. If you leave the DMX Cat E plugged in, the app will also tell users the last time it saw MIDI. Next, we can take a look at the Ethernet app. The Ethernet app allows users to view the sources on the network, like the main console, backup console, and button stations. It allows users to ping devices on the network or make a list of IP addresses and ping them all at once. The Ethernet app is also where users can change IP settings. Lastly, the cable testing app works with both 5-pin DMX and RJ45 cables. For Ethernet, users just plug in one end and it will verify the cable is wired correctly, as well as give you an estimate of the cable length. For 5-pin DMX, users can use the two XLR connectors on the device to test DMX cable. In the PoE tester app, we can see the voltages on the RJ45 cable the PoE tester also specifies the classification of the attached network switch. 
Other features include a built-in flashlight, an audible device finder for finding misplaced units. The DMX Cat E allows anyone with a smartphone to be able to turn on any DMX lighting fixture, as well as perform a wider range of tests and DMX analysis. The DMX Cat E will be your favorite lighting tool because it's easy to operate and you'll always have it with you.